Hello guys, in this very special video, we are going to speed up the computer. The steps which I am going to share are very simple and very powerful steps which will make your computer faster. So let's get started. So the very first step is to turn off the tips and notification. And how we can do that is just by doing a right click on the start icon and then go to systems. Now in the system, scroll it down and look for notification and actions. So here in notification, make sure all these check marks are unchecked and also look for any of the unwanted application is sending you the notification. So if you do not want that, you can simply turn off like this. So make sure you do that and now we will move to the next step and that is in the search bar we just have to type performance so once the performance options is opened look for adjust for best performance selecting this might change the appearance of your computer but trust me the performance will be way better than earlier so you can choose this or you can choose let windows choose what's best for my computer if it's already selected then select for best performance this best appearance will take more space more resources and make the computer so make sure this is not selected once this is done you just have to click on apply and move to the next step now the third step is to disable the transparency color effects just do a right click on the start icon and go to settings and in the settings look for personalization so the moment you open that look for colors option at the left hand side and scroll it down and turn off this transparency effect once this is done just close the window now the very important step is to disable the unwanted application at the startup. So for that, we just have to do a right click on the taskbar and open the task manager. You can op you can do a right click on the start icon and open the task manager as well. So here, just go to the startup tab here. This is a very important step which I uh, which I have shared in many of my videos. Now here, make sure make sure all unwanted applications are disabled so disabling the application from here does not mean you will not be able to use it you can use it it just it will not be at the startup without your permission so see I have only some Microsoft essentials turned on rest all of the applications are disabled from the startup like Skype Microsoft Teams OneDrive alright so OneDrive should also be if you're not using it make sure you disable it at the startup so once this is done we will move to the next step and that is removing the junk from the computer now there can be 15 20 30 gigabytes of junk sitting your in your machine and may slow down the computer to clean that we just need to press window and R and type clean MGR C L E A N M G R so the moment you press window and R you get the run option you can also search run here and you will get the run app so here once you type clean MGR click on OK it will open up the disk cleanup utility select all the un uh, check marks here including the recycle bin my computer is clean so it's not showing much but in your case you might have in you might have data in GBs so you can simply these are all the temporary cache created by the computer not by you so it's absolutely safe to do it so the moment you check mark just click on OK and now we are cleaning the computer and making our computer faster so the third now the next step is uninstalling the unnecessary application and for that we just have to do a right click on the start icon and go to settings and here go to apps 
Now in the apps, make sure any unwanted application which is installed, you do not know about it and it's not from Microsoft, you can simply uninstall it. Because you never know what kind of application is and how much resources it is using of the machine. So get rid of it and make your computer faster. Speed up your PC. So I'll just close this and we will move to the next step. And trust me, all these steps are very important. So make sure you do not miss anything. The next option, the next step is very crucial and we just have to open the browser because now we are looking for the viruses because if you have any kind of spyware, malware, trojans or any kind of virus in your computer no matter what you do the computer will be slow so to remove that we just have to type google.com and once the google is opened type malware bytes and hit enter now you can the very first result will be malwarebytes.com and once it is opened we just have to download so it's a free cleaner once you download scan for the viruses and once the virus is removed restart the computer and uninstall malware bytes alright now we will move to the next step which is the browser check your browser may have issues may have may have been compromised so if you're using edge just click on this three dots and go to settings and from here just reset the settings reset settings to their defaults now this will reset your startup page new everything except your favorites and history will not be cleared so don't worry your favorites and history saved passwords will not be cleared and it will reset your browser one more thing is you just need to click on this three dots and click on extensions and from here as well make sure you do not have any extension installed any unwanted if it's there remove it people who are using Chrome can open that and go to the three dots click on that three dots and go to settings and here in the advanced we just need to click on reset and clean up restore settings to their defaults and clean up computer cleanup is not required just restore settings to the default now again it will just reset the settings disable extensions and delete cookies and temporary site data so bookmarks history and safe passwords won't be infected won't be affected so don't worry about that okay once this is done if it's not if it's still slow or if you want to make your computer faster like a loading page what you can do is you can set up the DNS the website will load faster which is a great thing so just press window and R key together and type ncpa dot cpl so you can pause and note it down and then just hit OK now the moment you do it you will see the network connections here now make sure you select the connected adapter like in my case I have I'm using Wi-Fi so I'll just do a right click and I'll go to the properties and I'll select the internet protocol version 4 and I'll go to properties again and here I'll just type 8 then use tab or use the mouse 8 8 8 and here 8 8 4 4 so this is a Google DNS which is the fastest DNS of the world and once this is done you just have to click on OK and restart the computer and see how's the performance how's the website loading performance let me know in the comment section as well if it's working and not working for you the last step by doing all the steps if your computer is not working what I'll ask you to do is to reset your computer so for that we just have to type reset and click on reset this PC and this option will come recovery reset this PC we just need to click on get started 
and the moment you do it it will give you an option keep files or remove everything so it is up to you whether you want to keep your data your photographs whatever you have if you want to keep that you can select this and follow the instruction you will be able to reset your computer alright and if you have any other query any other problem let me know in the comment section I will surely help look at the history I reply to everyone so have a wonderful please hit the like and subscribe I'll see you in the next video take care